<laughs> Nurse, uh, what's the problem? It's okay. What of our blood pressure? 126. <laughs> She's okay. Uh, what of her dilatation? Five cm. <gasps> Five years out of my life. Oh, Rimon. But there was something. What actually was the problem? Did she attend all her accidentals? Did she take all her routine drugs? How, how, how can this be? How? So, Beatrice is gone. We won't see her again. We won't see her again. How? Well, what happened has happened. The only thing we are going to talk about now is how to bury her. That's all. Oh, brother. Huh? Henry. Well, we all have to realize that it's a taboo for a woman to die with her baby in her womb in her place. Hi. Nancy. Yes, we know that, Richie. A bitch's burial will not be. Elaborate since she'll be buried in the evil forest, I far away from home. Oh, it will never be well with anybody who has a hand in this misfortune. I mean, I mean, hey, maybe. But Michi, we don't have to blame anybody for this kind of death. Let us blame it on the lack of uh, medical amenities in our village. Eh? Then God will punish all, all people in the government. Let me get her government. Let me throw her her government. I get washing her. Um, like I said, I'll send my brother. Take her to you. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. When are we going to fix our baby? Okay. Well, yeah. It will be soon. You know, the earlier we bury our dead, the earlier we begin to forget the truth. That is true. But I have to consult the elders so that we 
want your house to be swept. I can quickly do it after sweeping the compound. That is if you will keep your key for me. No, 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 no. You don't need to worry. I've already done that. Ah, uh, uh, Mama, you shouldn't have. I wouldn't have minded. No, no. No, my dear. You see, I I don't want you to stress yourself. I mean, for all I know, you may be already be carrying our baby. And I wouldn't want to give you a back stressing job to do. <laughs> well, Mama, you're wrong. I am not. But even if I am, pregnancy is not sickness. I can still carry it and do house chores. No, no, no. Forget about house chores. For now. Eh? All we want from you is baby. Baby girl, you, baby boy, you, cripple, you, uh, blind, you, anything but a baby. That's all we need from you. And you know now, Beatrice is already dead. And you are the only one we are looking up to now. It's been long we heard the cry of the women in this family. Okay, Mama. God will do it. Yes. Uh, remember, heaven helps those who help themselves. You and Nebuka should not go and fold your hands and be waiting for God to do something. Hmm? Okay, Mama. Thank you. Have a nice day. Oh, thank you. There you are, my dear. You're welcome, my husband. Thank you. I was expecting you outside as usual. I didn't see you waiting for me. I'm sorry. I didn't know time has passed. Yeah, thank you. I understand how. Neka, what is it? Why are you crying? It's nothing. Nothing? And you're sitting here shedding tears, crying your eyes out. What is wrong? It's nothing really, like I said. It's just that... Something my mom, which you told me today, really got me thinking. Something my mom, which you told you. What did she tell you that put you in this mood? Like I said, it's nothing, okay? But I just realized that since Beatrice is gone, I'm the only wife left in this family. Uh -huh. And everybody's looking at me, you know, expecting me to start giving birth to children. Neka, why are you getting yourself worked up over nothing? Nothing. You think it's nothing? Ibu girl will be married for three years and not even a child to show for it. I think it's time we said I'm looking for a solution to this our problem. That's if you believe we have a problem. Because as far as I'm concerned, we don't have any problem. Why are you being stubborn? You're just being stubborn and you know it. See, if you don't want to take me to a place to find a solution to this problem, then I'll do it myself. After all, they say, heaven helps those who help themselves. Was that what Mama Mbuchi told you? She didn't need to tell me anything, okay? It's true, and you know it. 
and the earlier we started looking for a solution to this problem, the better for us. Mama, but you good evening. Ah, uh, okay. Mama. Good evening. You're already back from your workshop. Yes, I'm back. Thank you. Can I talk to you? Of course, yes. Why don't you sit down? Oh, thank you. So what is it you want to talk about? I hope there's no problem. Well, I came to talk to you about my wife, Neka. Your wife? What is it with Neka? You know it's been three years Neka and I got married. <laughs> Are you telling me? Did I not go with you to marry her? Yeah. You, you know, since Neka has been unable to conceive all these years, issues concerning children have become a touchy subject to her. I, I still don't get where, where this is going. Neka informed me that you told her something that made her remember her state of childlessness. And ever since then, she's been sorrowful and crying. Meaning Neka reported me to you? Did she say I castigated her her state? No, no, not of that sort. All I'm trying to plead with you is to at least be more discreet when discussing issues about children because it's a sensitive topic to her. Biko, hey! So, Neka reported me to you? No! Eh? Did she say I castigated her over her barren? State. Nothing of that sort. So what? All I came to plead with you is at least be more discreet when discussing issues concerning children since you know it's sensitive to her. Hey! You came to my house to open your mouth and talk to me anyhow. I don't blame you. Hey, Buka, I don't blame you. You can go ahead and talk to me anyhow. After all, that's what, 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 what people are doing to me in this family. Everyone now opens mouth and talks to me anyhow, travel on me, and then you will me in this family. What have I done to you people? What? Hey, bitch. Oh, she's la man. Hey, la man, oh my. I tell him, she. Your mom would you misunderstanding. Hey! I didn't mean it that way. So, which other way do you mean it? Tell me. Did you mean it that way? What are you? Hey, Why are you pursuing your voice in that manner? Why am I not going to raise my voice? Why would I? Eh? What all you people do in this family is to humiliate me, insult me, trample on me, and talk to me anyhow. Warn your brother. Warn your brother and his wife. They should leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. No. Oh. Am I the only widow in this place? Eh? Why won't you let me rest? Mama, I don't understand why you are raising your voice. I came here peacefully to discuss something. Then go away peacefully and leave me alone. Mind yourself. I will not take it again from you. I will not take it again from you. Leave me alone. He used. Mama, you must mind yourself. It's okay. It's okay. You want me to die? I will not die. Not die. It's okay. It's okay. Can you imagine? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Ha! Hey! Look at it. I even wanted to cook soup. Now I have lost appetite. We can blame you for making my life a desolate mystery. Oh God. Why? Woman. What in God's name did you say happened to you? I don't, I don't know. I just woke up this morning and I saw my chick like this. Hey! Maybe it's insect bite though. Insect what? Hey, it looks like insect bite. I don't know. All I know is that it will go with your care and then 
attendance. You. <laughs> but you know if I keep touching it, it won't go. I uh, heard now. If you are touching it, then you are enjoying the pain. <laughs> Ah, how, is that? Hey, how are you this morning? I'm fine. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I hope you woke up well this morning. Yes. Um, Ibuka. Um, I came to plead with you to please go and apologize to Mwechi for that ugly incident yesterday. What incident, Lee? I didn't disrespect Mama Mwichi in any way. I only went to tell her to be sensitive of my wife's situation. She blew everything out of proportion. She was offended in any way. Look, look I want you to understand that Mwichi, because of her circumstance, is not one of the happiest people around. And as a result, she is easily offended at every little provocation. My husband, please. I think I agree with them. Biko, go and apologize to her. Biko, go go back. Eh? Maybe she was truly concerned about our childlessness and all. We never can tell. Biko, eh? Okay. <coughs> Her duty. Her duty. I'll apologize to her. Oh, very good. Very good. Um, on that note, I think I should be on my way. I was actually going to the market. Okay. I'll see you on no, take all your time. <laughs> Who would blame you with a beautiful girl like this? <laughs> so have a nice time. Okay, yeah, thank okay. you. So go on. Eh? Except your wife, Neka, has remembered something else I said. No, no, on the contrary, I came to apologize to you. I realized I offended you with the way I spoke to you yesterday, even though I didn't mean it. Nick and I are deeply sorry. Oh. It's okay, my son. It's just okay. I also thought about it. And I I realized how offended my wife Nick would have been by my words. I mean told her how childless she is. But I empathize with her as both of us are in the same condition. I understood. Manuichi, I believe Neka will conceive and bear us a child. Of course she will. By God's grace, she will. It's been a long time our family shouted out for joy. But I, I am suspecting that Nekka's child is the one that will give us that. Ah, amen. Amen. I just got back from the market now. I want to go in and have my breath and rest my bones. So, have a wonderful night's rest. Eh? You too, my mom. Wish. Tell your wife not to worry. Okay. I will tell her. I will take care of you. I see. Ah, thank you. Ah, mama, stop now. Sing sweet songs. Hey, look at how radiant you are. Hmm? Are you sure you have not swallowed this? Hmm. I wish. The only reason I'm glowing, like you're trying to insinuate. It's because I am married to a loving and caring husband. That is all. <sighs> that is why I envy you. Envy one. Uh -huh. How come? Don't you know if it's another man who would have been disturbing you? Or even go and impregnate another woman behind you? You are very correct. You are correct. But not my Ebuka. Not my Ebuka. He can't do that to me. He loves me so much to do that to me. I'm very sure of that. <laughs> I pray for my own carbon copy of your husband. Seriously. But I am worried. Very worried. And I think it's high time I started looking for a solution to this problem. My husband will not care of it. He won't listen to me. In fact, I don't even know how to convince him. Uh, that is um his reaction from a man who loves you. Uh -huh. 
but don't listen to him. You are correct. But I don't know what to do. I don't even know where to start from. I don't know where to go. I know a doctor in the town hospital. I can go and meet him for you. And he'll recommend something or... I don't know. He can be of help. Are you serious? Yes. He can do something for me? Yes. Hi! Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Why are you thanking me for when we are cousins? Uh, yes. You don't allow me to forget that I'm cousins. Because I know we are cousins. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Ah. Yes, How are you? Yes. <laughs> Let me help with that one. Sorry. You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Simo, I pity that poor man. It won't be easy trying to forget a wife and a baby you almost had dying on the same day. Hi, pretty him, Sha. Huh? Well, I'm sure <clears throat> I think he should remarry, what do you think? Considering age is on his side. And he's single. I'm very hardworking. You hmm. see that day Osondo? He is more well to do than all that. Well that too. I'm sure our girls will not hesitate to consider him. Including you. Me, Kwa. You. I'm going. See ya. Go by the door. Are you going? Alright. Okay, I'm glad. Come on, see you. Okay, you see him. Alright. Hmm. This. Must be undoubtedly the best pan wine from the best tap in the whole village. Ah, day. Oh, yeah, kids, why you? I made sure I went to Mazi Uniguchi's place yesterday to order for this wine. Ah. I said it. What a wonderful way to start the day. I take it that your business trip this time went very well. Okay. Thank God, no. God is wonderful. He went perfect well. I was happy to hear. This one cannot lose on both sides. I am happy that God is favoring you on the business side of it. I thank God, though. I thank God. Um, Nani, there's this thing I've been meaning to talk to you about. Mm -hmm. Okay, what is it? I'm listening. It's about. Uh, Marriage line. Marriage. Who's married? Hey, man. You know, it, 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 it's, it's been six months since Beatrice's death. And I think it's high time I started looking for a woman to fill in the vacuum that she, she left in my life. What you said is very true. I, I thought of taking up the issue too, but the way I say things, you cannot be left to mourn forever. That, that's why I decided to make my day. Um, you know, getting another woman will help me forget her death easily. I'm very fast too. That's right. But um, do you have any girl in mind or you want me to start searching? Uh, they, as uh, unexpected as it sounds, I think. Uh, I've already seen someone. Wow. <laughs> well, that's no problem. Just pick up your man on the way you want to go and see the girl's parents. And uh, I will follow you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God will bless you. <laughs> Thank you for your support. Without you, I don't know what I'll have to do. You made them ready. I'll let you know. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Hey, Asandu. Good afternoon. Please. You're a workaholic. How can you be washing under the sun? Ah, babe, we need the sun for the clothes to dry now. 
Oh, okay, because you want the son to drag the cloth, you want to roast yourself. Eh? What can we do? Well, I don't know if you have a moment. There's something I've been meaning to discuss with you. So, what is it? Well, uh, there's this your friend, uh, very beautiful, that uh, visited you the other day that I came back from the city that uh, both of you came to the car and carried my goods in. Oh, that's my cousin, Ego. Oh, that's her name. Mm, she's a nurse. You know that my uncle, the village chemist, she's his daughter. And she's been the one that's been taking care of that chemist since my uncle died. Hey, it's your... Yes, that's it. Chineke me. What day? Why do you ask? Uh, he's not in serious, really. Just because uh, you are her cousin, her seem to be her best friend. And you should know, I just want to find out if she's in a serious relationship or engaged to the marriage. Well, I don't think she's in any relationship for now. Okay. I, uh, I'm sure you will be wondering why the curiosity. I, uh, I just want you to help your brother-in-law. Except you don't want me to be out of this, my you know, our status. <laughs> Why wouldn't I want you to be out? You know what? You don't have any problem. I will not only talk to her, I will chip in a good word on your behalf when I'm talking to her. I trust you. Eh? I trust you. Um, and I promise you, if you do this and it's successful, I will reward you handsomely. You know how I do things. Like <laughs> Like I said, you don't have anything to worry about. You see, this is my cousin. She's a very nice girl. She's very hardworking. And she's very respectful. Mm, that's good. That's good. Um, I, you know, both of you are very close. And your best of friends, despite your cousins, you know, women. <laughs> you know, you know if she's actually Ready for marriage? Well, I wouldn't know until I ask her. But I'll ask her, don't worry. I'll be waiting. Hmm? I'll be waiting for the good news. <laughs> because I trust you. Hmm? Uh, let me see that uh, banana is an audible. Kambara uh, or chago bar. Or chago. Banana. <laughs> well, <laughs> Okay. I'll give you the three days. You know? Okay. So. Three times daily. We're joking around and discussing about my brother-in-law that it will finally be you. Hey! No! Jeez. Hey! I'm still considering. I have not agreed on anything. Look at this one. Oh, oh, oh. You are still considering. Okay. Stay there and be considering. Do you hear me? Were you not the one that said that all the girls in this village will not think twice before grabbing the opportunity to marry him? And you're still there thinking. Uh, I did not include myself, did I? Please, 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 don't make me angry. Uh -uh. What is there not to love about my brother, you know? He's fine, he's tall, and not to talk about the fact that he's well rooted. He's well to do. Uh -uh. Oh, Diego. Ah. It's okay. Okay, I promise to give him some thought. Huh? As my sister, you know. Anyway, that's Get away. See this one. Get <laughs> Go. As a young. Nah, that reminds me. Remember that doctor that I said I was going to collect that drugs from? Down now. Give <laughs> me something for her. Yes. 
I'm going to get it for you so that you start the treatment. Thank God. But wait, wait, wait. Did he say it's the solution to my problem? No, but at least it will help me. Hey, go, my daughter. Mama. It is true our in laws are coming tomorrow to perform the marriage rites. But I must confess, I'm a little bit uncomfortable. Why, Mama? Osondo has the right choice of husband for you. The fact that he has been married before and... Ma, it is not his fault that he's a widower. Or did you hear that he killed his wife? No, 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 no. That's not it at all. But his wife died a very mysterious death. Have you heard of such a thing happening in a village before? Well, it is not strange in my own field. A woman dying at the point of delivery is due to complication and not any misery. And remember, I'm a nurse, okay? I can take care of myself. From the antenatal to the postnatal, I'm fine. Okay. If you say so. I say so, ma. Let's talk about the food you're going to prepare and stuff. Okay, now what I want to do is a good man. I'm still a little uncomfortable. Oh, okay. So you can on. How it is, you know. I understand it couldn't have been easy going through the whole marriage process a second time. You can say that again, but at least, you know, the most important thing is that I got a beautiful damsel in the whole baggage <laughs> that suits all the wahala. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> and don't forget that I now have my very own cousin inside this house giving up. So don't try me. Hey, what are you trying to do? Make us again. I can't say that again. Very yeah. yeah. soon, our wives will leave us to fend for ourselves oh. while they sit and discuss and gossip like sisters. <laughs> <laughs> Hassan! Uh, Mama? Good evening, ma. No. No. <laughs> I have come to. Welcome your new wife. Huh? You must be the one that you are holding so closely. Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> People have even started doing me more. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we are going home. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're welcome, my daughter. Thank you, Mama. <laughs> uh, I hear you are a nurse. Yes, Mama, I am a nurse. Welcome. I'm so sorry, I couldn't attend your traditional marriage. Eh? I was not feeling very well. You know old age, 
My bones are getting weak too. I'm so sorry about that. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So do not hesitate to call me when those old bones get cracking. I'm sure I'll find you something. I'm sure you'll be able to do it. Eh? Thank you very much. Eh, I brought you orange. Oh. Yeah. Thank you so much. You're so kind. Thank you very much. Uh, Mama, she said I should thank you. Uh, thank you. I have it. <laughs> thank you very much, eh? Okay. I I am going back to my house. Uh, Let me go and rest. Eh? Oh. Mama, it's Dalu. Oh, my dear. It's on my plate after all. Oh. <laughs> oh. Nice one. So don't go to I said I'm sorry. Yeah? How can I see you and still spit on you? Or you want to call me a mad woman? Hey, move on. Move on, Mama. You shouldn't mean it like that. I'm very sure. Be cool. Sorry. Don't be angry. You're sorry for yourself. Too. Our wife. Uh, sorry, please don't kill me because of my small mistake. Oh? Mama and Bechi seem so bitter and unhappy. Bitter what? <laughs> yeah. Troublesome and unhappy, yes. But you can't call Mama and Bechi bitter. She's just a victim of circumstance. Huh. Well, I don't think I like that. I won't blame you because I understand that feeling. You know, sometimes it's as if she goes out of her way to make herself very unlikable. And, and it's bad. Uh -huh. That's not even what I'm saying. What I'm saying is that my spirit does not accept her. Yeah. Oh, Lego. I do not understand this one. What do you mean? Well, yesterday, I had a dream. And in the dream, she wasn't portrayed as a good woman. She was portrayed as evil. Really <laughs> <laughs> good. This is my sister. You are beginning to imagine things, though. Let me tell you. You see that, Mama Mbuchi? I agree, but she's very irritating. Even me, sometimes I can't even stand her. But you see, the three years I've spent in this house, she has been nothing but an unhappy woman. That is it. Happy or unhappy, I don't like her. She's evil. My sister, please, stop imagining things. Let's see here. Eh? This woman is childless. She doesn't have anybody to sustain her. So think about that and give her the love and the pity that she deserves. That's all. Probably. 
Rest for a while, oh, so you get strength to go home. Sorry, can I get you something like a glass of water? No, worry. let me just rest. I hope your stepmother is fine. That one, ah, she doesn't care about me, so what's the Like someone that's ready for fight. I'm anyone offended you. Tell me now, let me go and do with you. I'll be my sister. Daddy, yes. is you have been waiting for yes. What's the problem? Is you have been waiting for? Yes, I'm back home. I'm back home. Just yes. tell me that you don't have anything to do with that old woman that was beating that stone from today. Daddy, what is this? Eh? I've been begging you, stop this thing you're doing now. Stop robbing people. This thing will be around on you one day, oh. You know you're all I've got. It's just you and I in this world. I mean, my sister, why are you disturbing yourself, an old woman? After all, she's not our grandmother. Why are you stressing yourself over hey. it? Yeah? Honestly, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. Daddy, she's not your grandmother. She's not somebody's grandmother. Oh, yeah. eh? See, you will give me every dime you stole from that woman today. Me? Daddy, give it to me. Ah, leave me alone. Daddy, give it to me. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Daddy! Hey! Is it like you kill me or oh, I kill you? Leave me alone. Where is that? Go, go, I'm going. Daddy! Daddy! In the morning to take care of myself, they will come and leave all of them and collect from me. <laughs> you children, you will never see anything good in your life. You'll be punished the way you are punishing me. You will never look for anything and have it in this life. You continue to steal from people and steal from people until you face your own face. You are not achievable. I didn't 
other than this useless boys dealt with me. Just bundle of thieves. We dealt with me. Mm -hmm. So don't worry, you'll be fine. Yeah? <laughs> I apologize on that behalf. No, you don't need to. After all, it's not your fault. Eh? It's just that I have so many chores to do. And I have nobody to help me. Now look at me. Eh? It's useless Mama, boys. Mama, they are really useless. Mama, don't worry. <sighs> See, that is why I'm here. I will help you do anything you want to do. Huh? Yes. Mama, are you are you sure? Mama, I'm sure. I'm sure. Can be doing video. I want for me to do for you. I'll do everything before you know it. I'm done. At any time you need my help, just call me. Mama? Mama, are you sleeping? No, I was just trying to rest my eyes. <laughs> okay, I came to tell you that I'm leaving now. I finished doing everything. Hey. And I told them, can I hear um, the one at the back? Ego. I told them to help me bring in the clothes when they are dry. Yeah. That one. Does she even care? Hey, my daughter, don't worry. You have done well for me. Eh? I'll go and collect the dresses when they are dry. Yo. Yeah. Mama. But you need somebody to take care of you now. Eh? Hmm. See, don't worry. Whenever you need my help, eh? just send for me. Oh? Eh? Such a Thank you. That's so beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Don't forget to eat, though. Eat very well and rest. Oh, that reminds me. I have soup. Why don't you come and eat? Don't worry, Mama. I'm fine. When next I come out, go for me. Well, Mama, let me run. Eh? Let me see you. Oh. Hey. Mama, don't worry now. My clothes and my wrappers. Yeah. Mama, I'm helping you pack the clothes so that the evening dew will not fall on it. Moreover, didn't the girl that helped you wash um, told you that she asked me to bring them down? Or is it that I can't do anything for you in this house? Huh? You? Do something for me. <laughs> hey! hey. What did I want that? Eh? Give me, give me, give me, give me. Come ah. give me. What is the problem? You daughter of. Uh, mommy water. Ma, you call me daughter of mommy water? Yes. If you must know. Eh? I knew who you are the moment you stepped into this family. Let's just wait and see what you become. That is, if you last longer than your dead mate. Hey, Ma! Hey, Ma! Okay, you take that long. Look at that. You think I don't know? <laughs> you people cannot do me anything. Look at it. My dress has not even tried yet. And she came to remove them. Mama, me water. Nonsense. My love, can you imagine? She called me Mommy Water's daughter. And that she cannot wait to see what would, you know, what I would turn out to be. All because I tried to gather her clothes now. I'm sorry about that. So all I want you to do is to disregard Mama Mochi's words. Just see it as an old man's ranting, okay? That's what everyone keeps telling me. Was I to disregard her? I mean, she even made an insinuation that I might not live long than your late wife. What? Yes. So that you mean Mama Mochi said that? Yes, she did. And I'm wondering why she would say a thing like that to me. Oh my God. 
respect. Listen, let me apologize on her behalf, okay? Don't take her serious at all. Okay, just, just see as an old man that is going through, you know, some face, a you know, frustrated old man. Trying, all right? She's making it difficult for me. Yes, you have to try harder. Listen, honey. You know, in this your present condition, just disregard anything that will make you quarrel with anybody. I don't need you getting worked up. You come on. Hmm? Listen, let me get you your tea, okay? Oh, that's my baby. <laughs> my baby's speaking. Thank you. Thank you, please. I hope there's no sugar in it. No, no, no. no. This way, I will report you to our husbands. Don't mind me. I don't know what's wrong with me. I've been feeling so lazy and tired. And then, anyway, I keep my head, I just slip off. I think I know what's wrong with you. Oh. Mm-hmm. Oh, what is wrong with me? The same thing that has been making my tummy grow bigger. Echo. Are you sure? Yes, you're showing the symptoms. Look at you. Wait, wait, Eko, are you sure it's true? Like, like, am I the pregnant? Yes, you might be pregnant. Ah, hold on. <laughs> Let's do this. Let me run the pregnancy test. You can be waiting for now. Let me get me water. How high are you there? <laughs> yeah. You made me the proudest man on earth today. Ah, <laughs> oh God, I've waited for so long to give you this. Wow. Thing. I didn't even believe it when the doctor said it to me. You have to say it five times. If you don't show me that results, I won't have believed in myself. How can I believe I'm gonna be a proud father of a bouncy baby boy? Bow, yeah. You're going to tell us something. Hmm? Hey! Is it that you have caught fire? That you no longer have shame. To do what they're supposed to do behind closed doors in the public. Ebuka, are you the only couple in this village that both of you are always doing like two beds in it? Hmm? And yet, what did you show for it? Mba, Mba, Mama Buchi, that's enough. Enough of that. Your words are beginning to get insulting. What is insulting you? I'm only advising you. Hmm? Don't let me can deceive you with this her bed like attitude. You better go look for somebody who will bet you there for you before it's too late. Okay? Mama. It's okay. It's okay. Baby. Don't do it. Pay her no attention. You know who Mama Buchi is. Mama Buchi, I thank you very much for your concern. I appreciate it. But I think it's rather coming late and not necessary at this moment because. Neck is expecting. Eh? Hey! That is good. Ha! Thank God, though! Hmm. Thank God. I hope it's not the kind of pregnancy of the more you look, the less you see. Get it last, too. Oh, yeah, go. I'm with you, Baza, no love. Oh, no, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, my Baza. Okay. That last one. Huh? Huh? I don't want to explain that. It's okay. You don't oh, have no. to bother yourself about what I'm with you, see, now. By now, oh, sure. No. Hey, stop this. Stop this. Yeah, because if I tell you, 
that uh, we are not surprised at this song. I'll be telling you lies. It's all right. My sons, I'm surprised to have unleashed surprise on you people. But I thank God that the issue I want us to discuss is not a life-threatening one. It is for the for my own betterment and all of us together. I see. <clears throat> You all know that I have no child of my own and I have nobody to take care of me. My late husband and his late wife have no surviving child to bear their name to. You know that? Indeed, Damboji. We already know that. I have thought about this thing and I have decided since I have nobody to take care of me. And I have decided to marry a wife for myself. Sir, what? Someone that will take care of me. Look after everything. And uh, succeed and Carry on with my late husband's name so that our lineage will not be wiped out or closed, as the case may be. <clears throat> I am uh, waiting. I am not sure I heard you correctly. Can you comment? Eh, 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 eh. Izuchi, I am sure you heard me well because I had no water in my mouth when I said it. You heard me? No, this is really your head of bed. At all. It is not possible. It will not happen in my father's compound. It will not. Okay, okay. Person, what is your head of? What is your head of? Is it that nobody told you or warned you that it's a sacrilege for you to marry another wife without mourning your late wife that died while giving birth to your cast son? Yes, 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 yes. That is totally off the line, and I demand the apologize to right now for that statement. husband was your uncle. What have you done for me? Have you ever come to knock on that door in the morning to see if I woke up? Have you ever given me food to eat? Do you buy clothes for me? So what can you say? Who gave you the right to talk? Eh? Oh Nonsense. I, I can't believe this. Mama Mbuchi, you have taken this too far. I know what the problem is. Your problem is that we have ignored you in this family for far too long. But I tell you, all that will come to an end today. Star! Hey. We won't take it no more. Hey! Ebuka has opened his mouth to talk. You must see what on this. Hey! Tell me what will you do? What will you do to me? Send me back to my, to my father's house. <laughs> you and all of you, joined together, cannot do me anything. Why don't you get them? Mbuchi. Don't provoke me. Even if your late husband was my uncle, with him and my father dead, I am now the head of this family and I deserve your respect. Hey! <laughs> head of the family indeed. Head of the family. 
What have you achieved as head of the family? Or as head of the family? What have you achieved? Not by showing the world your protruded stomach that will prove you as the head of the family. Listen, let me tell you. If you will not do what I want you to do, I will do it with or without you. Mm. Yes! You won't, yeah? Ow! Ow! Yeah, rubbish. Ha ha! Hand up the family. No, John, no, John. Hey, I'm not me. I'm All of you are evil people. Sit down. Hey, you, you won't allow her to bring any energy. What are you doing? There is nothing she's living for. Hey, what Mama Muji is asking for, it's very, very impossible. And we will not allow that to happen. Look, Onyema, what Muji is asking for is not totally impossible. I want us to understand that. Don't forget that it is still a practiced tradition in this village. And Remember, you should take this thing to Omona. You should take the issue to Omona. They may rule in our favor. I want us to have that at the back of our mind at all times. Tradition, my foot. Tradition, my foot, day. What Mama Mbuchi is asking for is a sin. Mama Mbuchi, what you are asking for is a sin. It's a sacrilege in the sight of God. And we, we, as a practicing Christian family, we will not allow you to have your way. Exactly. Then, mm -hmm. We will not allow her to have her way. It is your stupid new religion that is sacrilege. You are the sacrilege. You. What stupid faith are you talking about? Mama Mochi. Mama Mochi. Talk to Mama Mochi. Mochi. Yes, yes, yes. Did you see that? See what? Did you see that? I will give it to you again. It's okay. It's okay. Then, oh, my God. I am, I am taking this because of you. I know. I know. If God has not punished all of you for all the atrocities you have been committing. He wouldn't even near me because I, I married a girl for men to pregnant for me. He will not. But what is wrong with you? What has come over you? Eh? Let her talk. But we will not allow you. You will not have your way. We will not sit down, fold our hands, and watch you bring shame and curse upon our family. Exactly. Mama Mochi, it will not happen. Wow. Which family are you talking about? The one that is already cursed. Look at all Cursed! Eh? Now listen to me. Any tree that stands on the way must surely be cut down for people to have expert way. Cut down! Do the Would you just tell me, what exactly do you mean by that? A puzzle. Puzzle for you! If the bride price paid on your mother's head, your late mother's head, was not in vain. That's a puzzle for you. I am respecting this white on your head. Do. Please, Uchi. You have to. Come! Do it! If you do it, your hand will bend like this. Oh, I'm a you. Yeah. Please, Uchi. Oh, yeah. 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 Did you hear what she said? Does Anto? In Rio? Sit down. You just came back. Five, five, five. Five, five, is anybody home? Oh, Mama is here. Yes, my dear. How are you? I'm not looking very cheerful this morning. Is anything wrong? My brother. Your brother? The one you said is mischievous. What happened to him that you're crying like this? I don't know. I don't know what happened to him. He just disappeared. And I've not seen him since then. Well, you said this is all, always up to mischief. Maybe that's why he is. No. No. It's all like 32. Not to come home every night. He makes sure he returns home every night 
At least to see me because the both of us are all we've got. I understand. And what is your stepmother doing about it? She doesn't even care. After all, he's not her son, so what's her business? Mm. I see. Tell me, when did you start looking for your brother? Maybe I should help you contact the police. You know, that day you were attacked by things, remember? He came home and then we had a quarrel. He left in anger. I thought he was just going to his friend's house. Since that day, I've not seen him. Even his friend is nowhere to be found. Okay. I see. <laughs> I'm sure that wherever your brother Fedi and his friend are, must be a place that suits them. Hmm? They are of age now. They, they know what they want. They can do what they want. It's okay. Hmm? Stop bothering your beautiful head. Oh? Everything is alright. No, oh, come. I'm sorry for bothering you with my problem. No need to worry. Are you sure something must have brought you? Yes, something you did brought me. Let's go inside. Should I get a seat? Uh, maybe outside will be better. Okay. Mama, oh, honestly, I, I don't understand. This thing sounds so strange. It doesn't sound strange at all. It's not even unheard of. Besides, it's our tradition. I want you to think about it. And this one that your stepmother doesn't even care about you. Your brother is nowhere to be found. You are left all alone on your own. I am going to be a mother to you. And also see to your other needs. Honestly, Mama, you really have to give me time to think about this. By all means, think about it, sleep over it. But please, let your decision be favorable to all of us. Yes. I'll let you know. It's okay. Thanks very much for giving me time and listening to old man widow like me. God bless you. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Buy your soap. I know nobody takes care of you. Hmm? Thank you, ma. You see, when you accept me, you will enjoy more. All my husband's plus of land will belong to you. We have so many cash crops, a lot of them will give you palm trees, or a lot of them, they will belong to you. Oh, think about it. Thank you, Mama. Thank you very much. Moreba, I don't want you to cry because of your brother again. Eh? Oh. 
have waited for at least one month. Oh, uh, yes. Before striking. Eh? You see, now my enemies will start thinking that I'm the one that killed him. Just a day after our morning. Ow! Oh, we are going to you. Yes. Ow! God knows I'm innocent too. I'm innocent too! My enemies will start happening that I'm the one that killed him now. Eh? Hey! Yeah, 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 yeah. Mochi. Mochi. Will you keep quiet? If you don't know how to mourn, you better sit down quietly and close your mouth. Is it cheating? No. I will shout. I will shout. Oh. Eh, you think I don't know all your evil thoughts against me? You think I don't know? Eh? You want to accuse me of killing me? Are you listening? And you claim our property, isn't it? My man will jog in a day. Hey. What is wrong with you now? Oh, we are gone. Has we are gone. anybody accused you of killing anyone? Why are you putting up this show now? Why? No, John, no, John. Eh? No, I just had to accuse him me. Mama, must you stop this madness now? What is wrong now? Eh? Why are you embarrassing everybody here? Don't let me do something that I'll, I'll, everyone will regret here. Hey. Eh? What, is, what is it? You did this here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, it's okay. My tears are under. Go ahead. Do your worst. I'll attack you at the moment. Yeah. Go ahead and do whatever you want to do here. Oh, what is Mbechi, Mbechi, will you keep quiet? Yeah, yeah, I'll send you. Drag her to her room and lock her up there. Drag her to her room and lock her up there. Mbechi, Mbechi's attitude in this family is becoming unruly as the days go by. It's high time we cautioned her. Yes, dear. I mean, can you imagine the kind of disgrace she heaped on us on the day of Onyema's burial? This whole village has not stopped talking about it. The one that puzzles me the more is how she was able to conceive the idea that we must be blaming her for Onyema's death. When the doctor said Onyema died of cardiac arrest. Today, are you surprised? That woman is a drama specialist. Oh, you believe all those things she says? Okay, now, didn't you hear what she said the day we my sister? She is very, very lucky that she's a member of this family. Cardiac arrest or no cardiac arrest, I would have seen to it that she paid dearly for her words. Next time, she will be careful what to say, not to say anything carelessly. Well, Osando, that seems to be the least of our problems now. Ipe paid me a visit early this morning. Uh, what for? It's like we should report her to the owner because of our refusal to allow her marry for her late husband. She what? what? Izuchi. Your late uncle's wife, Uwechi, brought a report against you and your brother. Is that so? Uh, what did she complain that my brothers and I did to her? It's okay, it's okay, Izuchi. I think since the complainant is here present, we should allow her to speak. Good. 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 Can we hear you? My elders, I thank you. Thank you for running so quickly to the aid of a poor widow. Thank you. God bless you. My elders, my people have neglected me. Even their wives don't know whether I'm alive or not. Nobody helps me. I now told them, that I want to marry a girl that will take care of me and also bear children for my late husband. Huh? Did I ask for too much? Um, in, in fact, I does. This is a family issue. And we are old enough, we are wise enough, we are intelligent enough to handle this matter the way we didn't fit. If you if we not say to handle it, you will not invite extended families or elders to come and judge this matter but as it is now we will settle this matter in our own way no you lie you have failed already Asando. Eh? everything that will be settled will be settled here and now not later you have failed Mochi, i am disappointed in you i am the one that is disappointed in you i am disappointed that you are you are plotting to 
to acquire all my husband's property and share it amongst your brothers. Is that the part of the group? Are you mad, babe? No, I'm French. Did you hear that? Did you just hear this mad woman? Hey, Buka. Was it not your mother that was mad before she died? And right now, inside the grave, she's still mad. Onyara. Neng, Onyara. Inside the grave. Enough. Which is enough. Please, have your peace. No, please. I'm so sorry. It's just that anything has just gotten up to this place. It's all right, Mbeji. We understand your predicament. And what you're asking for is not totally unheard of. In fact, it is our practicing tradition in this our village. Practicing or no practicing, this will not happen in our family. Simple. She will not go and take a wife. It is not possible at all. We have said, Mba. You have no right to stop Mechi from picking a wife. Oh, hey! Listen to me, listen to me. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Since your wives will not take care of her, it all will do. Oh. You pick a wife that will take care of her during her old age, I'm just children for her husband. Hey, that's all I'm saying here is that Mechi has the right to pick a wife. Have I spoken your mind? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Hey! Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I do not accept that. Look, ours is a Christian family, and we cannot indulge in such sacrilege. Do you hear me? Too bad, Jesuji. The elders have spoken, and there's nothing you can do about it. Yes, we are talking about it. It is a matter of time. You think you can come back and do it? You are not going to do it. 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 You yeah. Okay. If you ask me, you should send her back in, back to her father's house. Of what good is she to us yet? That to make trouble every other day. But you know that is not possible, or something. It's not possible. I will do I don't get it. What are you suggesting? That we fold our arms and watch that woman have her way? Well, I'm afraid that is what is going to be. You see, the only thing we have to do now is to play along with Mbechi and her new wife when she comes. We are poor. Stop it or beat it. I will not try it. Well, uh, Hassan, the decision has been taken by the woman now. And there is nothing we can do about it. If uh, you two will allow me, I want to go and sleep. My eyes are practically closed. Well, excuse me. Good night. Okay, come with you. What's on? I have to go in now. When you're done, you can go. Go grab my brother. All right. Got you, Bob. Chinaka! Please just calm down. Oh, you, you got me scared. If you're living like this, when I'm pregnant, what will you do if I'm in labor? So, I believe if you're in labor, I will be perfectly alright after care of it. Mm. Trust me. <laughs> alright, sit down. Let me go get your place. So, 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 go outside. Let the plate be there. Just, just. You can't leave the plate outside. Let the plate be there. Come on. Come on. Sit. Okay. Oh, you need to rest.
Consented into marrying an old woman. I can't even believe it myself. I can't. Maybe it's circumstances or something. Maybe there is something somewhere we don't know. Because, hey, I cannot understand what will make a girl like this to subject herself to a life of slavery to an old woman. What circumstances? Is there circumstances not better than uh, uh, being a paid maid and a prostitute to yeah. a woman? Yeah. Oh. Do you know sometimes, eh? I wish I knew what Mama Mbuchi promised her that made her accept such an outrageous proposal. It is not my business. My own is let her not go out one day and go and get pregnant by a madman. No, 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 no. no. Oh, 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 circumstances. Oh, my God. Oh. My husband is so amazing. <laughs> hey, I see my husband there. He can't stop touching me. Marrying a man is the best. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That when you told me that your family despises you, I didn't know it was to this extent. Neglect is an understatement. If you ask me. No wonder. No wonder none of them came with you when you came to marry me. Do you know that since I got into this compound, nobody has ever given me a common nod of the head in greeting. Do you know that they even saw the wives? They just sat down there laughing at him. What? Those fools were laughing at him? No. They were laughing at their stupidity. Trust me now. I showed them that laughter is not being bought in the market. Oh, wow. <laughs> I laughed at them. Oh, we are going to yeah. <laughs> All they do is gossip, gossip, gossip. <laughs> My dear, listen to me. Don't let any of them take advantage of you. Eh? Don't let them trample on you. The kingdom of this family suffered violent, and only the violent take it by force. By fire, by force. <laughs> Mama, trust me. A jimo woman, and I am ready to be their doctor in this country. I am solidly behind you, Gitwa. Don't be afraid. If any of them show face, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, <my. laughs> Odi 
Yeah, what is this? Hey, I am talking to you. I said, what is this? What are you doing? My name is not Bianco Chikurume. So I'm sure some people are not talking to you. Amaka, you are very stupid. Do you hear me? Very, very stupid. Because it is only a stupid person that will spread her wet clothes on top of dry ones. Hey, <laughs> good. Oh, so you know my name, Ina Bombia. It is you. And that's your stupid work with that mate that are stupid. Yes. Ndashiri. Ndojo, Ndojo. If you know these clothes were dry, why didn't you take them in yourself? And if you bring it in for me, will you die? Ask boy boy. Do I look like your mate? <laughs> you make me laugh. So you want to hear it from my mouth? What else are you if not a maid of the lowest order to the language? Ah! Idiots. Open that to your own she and come and call me a maid again. Yeah, I'm not a you. You slapped me. I will slap you again. Can you get You are not scared. Scared or afraid of me. <laughs> hey! What is it? Is this bloated goat disturbing you? What are you here, Mama? I don't believe this. So you are the one that is encouraging this shameless idiot to behave the way she does. To the extent that she doesn't even listen to simple correction. Who is correcting you? <laughs> my God. Amaka, my wife. Correct her for me. I have already given her one dose. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> I trust you. Lele, what do you know that you are correcting somebody? Don't you know that somebody who is carrying Euro code 3 in her eyes cannot correct somebody else? Who taught you for you to be able to correct somebody else? <clears throat> anyway, I know what both of you are trying to do. But you will not provoke me to a fight. Move As for you, Amaka, you are going to pay for slapping me. Unless my name is not on that. In fact, I'm going to report you today, Zuchi. What's up? Hey, did you hear that? Did you just hear my language? Now it's obvious she's the one encouraging this girl to be insolent. Because this girl had a name. If anybody wants to address me, she call my name. Ha! Shut down your insolent mouth. Do you really think anybody cares who, or what your name is? Hey! Who called you into this matter? Did anybody call your name? I can really shut up your mouth. Say, will you shut up your mouth or I'll be forced into disciplining you myself? Discipline who? Why should you shut up? Why is Uchi? What about your wives that are running their mouth like like a Shotoro? Why would they shut up their own mouth? Eh? She will not shut up her mouth. You think it is those days when I didn't have anyone to speak for me? Eh? Eh? Also, then, Mujida will be okay. I can see you are the one encouraging this girl to slap a pregnant woman. Oh, well. I'm like, I demand that you apologize to Nick this minute. Apogin? Hey. It's Uchi. You don't mean it, do you? Uchi. I have never been more serious in my life than now. I demand that you apologize to her here now. Uh -huh. If she doesn't, what will happen? You should be ashamed of yourself, Mama Uchi. I should think that a woman in your childless condition would understand and appreciate my wife's situation. Now I see why God has punished you. I have seen it because of your wickedness. He has refused to bless you with a child of your own. Hey, Buka, you dare open this God and you call him out to say that to hey, Buka, you use my condition to scorn me. Hey, Buka, you will be glad this time. Yeah. Let's go. So we regret every time of the day. Stupid. Let's go. 
Actually, it wasn't Mbuchi I came to see. Mm. I've come to talk to you about uh, what is going on between you and your mates, Nick and Ego. <laughs> hey, ah, is there anything going on between us? Um, Amaga, you see, you, Nick and Ego, are supposed to live in peace and harmony, be married into the same family. But somehow, Uluchi has been encouraging you otherwise. Ah, they. Mama Uluchi is not encouraging me to do anything. Neither is the problem I'm having with um, Ego and Neka entirely my fault. Neka and Ego are also to blame. Yes, I know. And I will talk to them. You see, there is need for us to pursue peace and love. Ah, it's very important. Peace. Peace. It's love. Isuchi, what are you doing here? Put in love to my, my, my wife. Hey, Isuchi. Hey! No one about in the room. Everybody come on here. Isuchi wants to taste the forbidden fruit. He wants to be the first, though. Isuchi. Isuchi. Hey! After all your holy and thou attitude, I wouldn't believe that you'll be the Want to, want to do me grimo. The first to do me grimo with my wife. Hey, hey. Richie, what is it and what is she ranting about? Who's ranting? Who is this? Hey. Who is ranting? Eh? You have to go up here. Who is ranting? Daughter of a witch. Which what has come over you? Eh? How dare you accuse me of such a thing? I just came here to play with the with her mother to mend fences with her mates. Neck and ego. How can you accuse me like that? You, Amaka, why don't you tell your husband the truth? Tell her that there is Uchi here does not even notice you as a woman, not to talk of trying to pee in that public. <laughs> is it now your turn to insult me? <laughs> Better go and ask your mate Neka how I dealt with her. If you dare insult me again, I will beat you into premature labor. Oh, Amaka, you make me laugh. Amaka, leave this one. <laughs> leave this one. This daughter of Mami Wata. She already has death sentence hanging on her head. She's only looking for someone who will lay hands on her so that she will accuse the person. Hey! Ah! Mami, let me tell you, I will not tolerate this your insult and try a habit of throwing curses up and down, thinking nobody can do anything about it. What can you do? What would I get make any crime, Amaka? What will you do? What will you do? What will you do? Amaka. Can you get that? Leave it. Leave it. Oh, leave it. 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 Come on, say! John G. Back in dog. Come and say! One keta. Come and say! Come and say! Come I have never seen a town where cops is move about. Come. Come. What? Him? Come. 
So well mannered. You are exactly what I want. How oh, exactly do you want? <laughs> uh, there's something I want you to do for me. Hmm? We accept us to do this work. We'd be highly appreciated. Oh, Ma, please. Are you? I'm confused. <laughs> what exactly do you want? You see this? Eh? Yeah? This is ordinary change compared to what you get if you accept to be this one for me. Come on, please tell me what exactly I'm going to do for you. Let me know whether I'm going to do it or not. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, it's okay. Available anytime, any day. Just give me a call. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. This is for your beer. It's okay. Eh? More you. of this will come your way. You want to start the work? Trust work. me, ma. Trust me. Eh? Trust, Trust me. me. Yeah. Okay, now. Yeah. It's okay. It's a deal. Cool. <laughs> All right, ma. Thank you very much. Mwa, ma. Uh, thank you, ma. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, yeah. I was saying, my dear, it is time for us to talk about uh, the next thing and the most important one that made me marry into this family. You know, it is for you to start bearing to them for me. My mom. Well, I was thinking you'd give me some time to get used to this idea. No. Well, there's no time. How about where that time is for me, ma? Eh? Look at Neg and Ego. Do you know how long they have been working with their husband? And yet, no shoe. Although I know that you're a sharp goalkeeper, mm -hmm. eh? you'll be able to catch this girl fast. Mm -hmm. eh? Okay, Mama. No problem. I promise you, I'll start you know, looking for a man that suits me. No! You don't need to worry yourself. I have already arranged all that. <laughs> you have? Of course, yes. I'm sure you like him. You see him? Very handsome young man. Very handsome. And that man is even ready to do everything we ask him to do without much pressure. Ha. Mama, me, I don't want any chingon boy with smelly mouth to come and carry his mouth all and rub all over my body. Then give Eh? No problem. You will like it, I'm sure. Eh? You know, you are the Delilah. Eh? By the time he, he, he uses that in something hard to touch every part of your body. <laughs> Samson and Delilah. Samson and Delilah. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you fix this? It's my heels. Are you sure? Yeah. What? Samson, Samson. <laughs> I hope you enjoy yourself. Why not? Mm -hmm. Is this for me? Yes. Ha! You must see you. You must see you. You are the master of the house. <laughs> I told you, the whole house is yours. Huh? Any, any part of the house. I'm going on to see my friend. She's my okay. mama. She's okay. Eh? <laughs> but, Unless something productive come out of this Hey! <laughs> Mama! Jinkwaya wayo! Mama, you don't trust me. See, when I'm through with all these jobs, 
you will know that I'm a German machine. German machine! Hey! Give me that German machine. You will hear the story, man. The house belongs to you. Any room, any room. It's all right. Okay. I'm well. See you again. I don't want to do this to me. I mean, my dear, tell me the truth. How did it go? I hope Samson did not prove himself a disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mama! <laughs> Mama, why are you asking me this kind of thing now? Eh? Must you know everything? I must know everything. I must know. If the man is the right, eh? Don't you know that the health and intelligence of our child depends on that? Mm. I don't know. Okay. Mm. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> I enjoyed myself. Hey, Abby. <laughs> you see, you guys of nowadays, eh? <laughs> when I was talking to you about it, because this. You are saying no. <laughs> now you are enjoying everything. <laughs> God forbid. Hi! So, why of you are sitting here discussing your illnesses activities in this village? Oh, so you both are intentionally trying to drag the family's name into the den of prostitution. Hi! Ego or whatever they call you. Did you or are you trying to call me a prostitute? Do I have to spell it out for you? How? What else are you if not a prostitute? Huh? Hmm. You know, I always imagine. I wonder why a beautiful girl like you will allow this old wicked woman to ruin your life. Do you think I'm going to Effort to come to my house and talk to me eyeball to eyeball. Yes, because somebody needs to call you to order. You shameless fool. Oh, oh my god. No, stop. This evil thing both of you are doing. God don't want to punish you. You are not back to judging her. It's yours. It's okay, so, Mama, are you out of you? You think you are the one that will call me to order? You. <laughs> Leave her. I will personally handle her case. <laughs> She has finished everything. She says what you are carrying is balloon. And balloon it is. <laughs> mama, mama. Uh -uh. Huh? Are these chores so necessary that you have to stress your poor wrists? Huh? Well, I didn't hear the poor West complain. Cheers. Welcome home, Obi. Thank you very much, Mama. So, how was work today? Well, I'm up for today. Um, you look tired. Of course I am. I'm really, really tired. Why don't you go in, remove your clothes. I've put cold water in the bathroom for you. <laughs> while I go to the kitchen and prepare your food. Hey! Mama. Let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. Do you know you are much better to me? Wife. Doesn't mean that you're not going to marry okay. because I need to carry my grandchildren. Right. I heard you. I heard you. Okay, that's not a problem. So, if you'll excuse me, huh? It's okay. Just go inside, move your clothes, eh? All right, thank you. No problem. Don't stress yourself much. It's all right. Okay? No Thank you. 
Obina. Obina. You barely touched your food. Why? No, it's not simply food. It's not tasty. It's just that I have a lot of things going through me right now. I've noticed that for some time now. Is something bothering you? Tell me, what is it? Um, I don't know if you have me solve the problem now. I don't know. Go ahead and tell me. I am your mother. Talking to me should not be difficult for you. Oh? So, go ahead and tell me what is it. Mama is my father. Your what? Yes. I want to know who my father is. I want to know where he is. Let me go look for him. I'm a grown man now and I need to know who my father is, Mama. Just tell me. Please. Mama, you're crying. Mama, listen. Okay? Listen to me. If it's a desire to know who my father is, that is keeping you this anguish, then let's forget about it. No, no, no. Don't have to say that. I don't want to see in this condition again. Okay? Mm -hmm. Let's just forget about it. Please. You have the right to know who your father is. And I believe that one day, this will happen. But, Mama, shh. We are children. They want fire all those years. They have come to live in the same yard as in husband while I was a baby. When he got me pregnant, my madam in the city, my madam had him. Locked him up. She returned me back to the village. That was how we lost touch. Mama, it's okay. Hope you know. I'm ashamed of myself when I think of not telling you. Shh, Mama, it's okay. To be ashamed, okay? And I'm not judging you. After all, something good came out of it. Me. You are my precious. I love you so much. I love you too. Gosh! Baby, from the energetic kick of this baby, I can perfectly presume that it's going to be a boy. <laughs> So from this kick, you can determine? I'm telling you. So does that mean girls don't care? No, not as strong as boys. See, um, from what I know now, I think I advise that you start, um, you know, um, um, shopping gradually for the baby and make sure that the things that you're going to buy will be for baby boy. <laughs> okay, I'm you. Alright. But that reminds me, now that I still have the strength, I think I should start shopping. Oh, why not? Anytime you're ready, just let me know. Okay, I'm ready today. No, oh. oh, no, I need to hurry, man. I told Ned already that she'll go with me. Okay, so like, like how much will you be needing? Never give me money. Oh. You're a wonderful wife. You are my best wife. <laughs> <laughs> my bestest. <laughs> let me just uh, give you what I have now so that. Uh, Uh, tomorrow, if you're going, I'll complete it. Hmm? Let's see. For a baby boy, the money will be bigger. Can you imagine? Um, I'll give you um, something like this again tomorrow. This should be like um, 20 or so. So I'll give you another 20 tomorrow so you start. So that my boy. <laughs>
God, who have I offended? Why have you vowed to keep me in perpetual agony? Terrible! First it was Beatrice, and now it's a girl! Jai! It's okay. Jai! Very sorry for your loss. Eh? <sighs> but we cannot question God in things like this. Even Job suffered the same fate. You have to bear this like a man. There is nothing the eye will see that will make it to shed blood. Take heart. God knows best. Oh, Taro be one name. Oh. Ah, God will definitely punish this hit and run driver. Reckless hit and run driver. See how heartless people can be. Eh? Ow! What a waste! What a waste! How a go wabo! Ow! Mama Mbuchi. Oh, yeah, leave. What have I done? Why are you sitting down here shedding crocodile tears? I'm sure my wife will not want to cry over her death. Now get out of this place, you wicked witch. Before I'm uh, practically do something of wicked Osundo. now. Get out of this place now. Osundo. Osundo. Osundo, Osundo calm down. Osundo, come on. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Hmm? Sit down. Osundo, don't. Let your sorrows be cloud your sense of judgment. Huh? Hey, because, 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 let him talk. It's about time someone told this woman some truth in this compound. All of us are witnesses to the fact that all Mwiti does is to curse, abuse, and say evil things about our wives. Now she has come to shed crocodile tears. Hey, so she, did you hear your brothers? Your brothers are accusing me of killing their wives. Ah, whoa. All of you here are my witnesses, so oh. you are my witnesses. What have I done? What have you not done, Mbechi? What have you not done? You never loved my wife, and as such, I see you as a hypocrite and those no crocodile tears. Now, go to your house before I do something that I will regret right now. What? Oh, you heard him. Mama Mbechi, go to your house and mind your business. Mama Mbechi, go to the other side of the compound. Go from today. They have my house. I beg you in the name of God. Uh, I don't want to see you anywhere around this house. Okay? Mind your business. Lawa. Amaka Mama, have you heard? You all are witnesses, so they said I should go and mind my business. Hey, whoa. Amaka, let's go and mind our business. Oh. Amaka. Amaka But you that cannot even hurt a fly. Hmm. Eh? Izuchi and his brothers are accusing me of killing, killing Ego. Just like that. Mama, it's okay. Hmm. Eh? It's okay. Don't mind those wicked people. How can they accuse you of killing Ego? Have you become a hit and run driver? Even God knows that 
It was just an accident. That is it, my dear. But who is there to defend me? Amaka, hmm? who will fight for me? Hmm? When all they do is maltreat me and accuse me wrongly, who will fight for me? Mama, have you hmm. forgotten that you now have me? I will fight for you. Let me just hear those, those onushi. Let me hear them talk rubbish about you again. And I will fight them regardless that they are men. God. God. God in heaven. Lord, only you know that I am harmless and blameless. Only you. Hi. Izuchi and his brothers will never know peace until they have cleared my name. Amen, Mama. Amen. Mama. Let's go and sleep. If night is fast, friends, let us go and sleep. Good night, my dear. Hi, Mama. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'll enjoy you. Stop thinking, we'll come and sleep. I'm gone. Might not be ordinary. What? What are you talking about, Neka? Stop it! Biko! Ego, hey, are you blind? Can't you see what is happening? Ego wasn't the first person to die with pregnancy. Beatrice did! And now I'm scared I may not survive this pregnancy after all. Chineke Kweli Hojo. Neka, can you listen to yourself? Chibo. How could you even conceive such evil upon yourself? Listen to me. You're going to bear this child safely. This baby is going to wipe the tears off her eyes. Biko, no, no. I wish I believed you. I want to believe you. I desperately want to believe you, but I'm so scared. I know what I'm saying. This is not ordinary. I'm seeing it. This is not ordinary at all. At all. Please, please believe me. God knows I will never let anything happen to you. I get me, Mia. Please, please. Nega, who is that? Nega. Nega, 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 Nega,
so you are Izuchi's son? Yes, sir, I am. So you know my father? Yes, I know him. He was my father's houseboy. I was a kid then. He impregnated a neighbor's maid. Wow. And my father sent him away. Oh, well, sir, if I may ask, do you know where I can locate him? As in, do you know where he lives now or anything about him? There was this cousin of his that used to visit him. Okay. He went to stay with him after my father sent him away. Okay. All right. Um, so, um, can you tell me, direct me how I can locate the cousin or where he lives or anything? Can I really remember where he lived then? I think he lived at number... God, is this how you are? This God is wonderful and merciful. You said you are Izuchi's son? Yes, Chief Ubaka. Actually, my mother told me that he's my father. Oh. God bless her for not researching the abortion as other girls of her age did in the past. Indeed, Chief. Chai! Thank God. So, yes, but you are truly welcome. Thank you very much. How is your mom? Well, she's fine. Actually, I must confess, it's really an honor to be welcomed to your house. I never expected it to be like this. My mother will be so happy to hear this good news. Oh no. <laughs> you are welcome. Thank you very much. Wait until your father, Izuchi, learns of your existence. He'll be very happy to reunite with you and the entire family. You're welcome. Thank you very much. It must be celebrated. It's not every day one gets united with his family. I mean, this calls for real celebration, you know. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much. Let me get into the kitchen. Thank you. Get something. Get something, yeah? Chief oh. Obak. Yeah. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. So that was what happened at the shop when I was not around. Okay, I, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Yeah. Ah, Chief. This is a surprise. Welcome, ah. sir. Ah, thank you very much, Ebuka. How are you and your lovely wife? We are very fine. Okay. This one you came this night. I hope all is well. Yeah, very well. Um, in fact, I drove straight from the city to this place. Ah. Is everything all right? Very well indeed. In fact, um, where is Izuchi? My reason for coming concerns him, and it is of great importance. Um, the Izuchi is not around now. He went down the village path to see his friend. But I can go and call him and tell him you came. No, don't bother about that. I think I'll have to go and come back tomorrow morning. Ah. Uh -huh. Yes. Okay, let's go in so I can... No, 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 no. Don't, don't bother yourself. Let me go and shower. Tomorrow morning I'll come back. All right, in that case, let me walk you to your car. Sorry. Ubaka, my brother. I want you to repeat before my brother's here, what you just told me. Because I I may not have understood you very well. Hmm. Is it you, my brother? I said, after all, you are not childless. Hmm? After all, you have a son. Hmm? Yeah. Bought to you by Nene. Hmm? Remember the maid? You remember that the maid when you were a houseboy? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> this is... This is unbelievable. Jay, God, if this is true, eh? <coughs> Day, <laughs> Meme. Oh. Meme. Oh. Wait. Do you seriously mean what you have just said? You're trying to tell us that my brother here has a son to succeed him after all? I am not talking child's play here. His name is Obi now. I saw him myself. Hey! She did Oh! Oh, Basu. Yeah, it's called, honestly, I'm a happy artist. Neka, you can't imagine how happy days with cheese sounds return has made everyone. 
Huh. Are you telling me? I said, this Zuchi has been walking on the clouds with his shoulders high ever since that visit from Chief Ubaka. Even you and your brother, you people are so excited and it puzzles me. Like I won't understand, honestly. Mm. Make me understand now. Because I don't get why Deizuchi should be very happy at the uh, uh, prospect of having a son. When I was under the impression that he didn't want any. Because if he had wanted, he would have gotten married to someone else after his wife's death. Nobody was stopping him from getting married. Like I said, you won't understand. Listen, it's not like Deizuchi did not want to remarry or have kids. The truth is, that accident that took his wife also took something precious from him. Oh. So what did he take from him? It rendered him important. Hey! It took his manhood. Chineke! So, that's why he's this happy, you know, he had given up hope of ever becoming a father hey. until Obina surfaced. Oh. No wonder. Is that why he's big? And all of you are. Hi. Make a I didn't know. Uh, yeah, yeah, I know. It's not a topic we enjoy talking about. Hi. Anyway, now that I know, I am very, very happy for him, honestly. In fact, if you ask me, I think this deserves a big celebration. A very big one. In fact, the way we're planning it, eh? It's gonna be grand, like the whole village will hear the echo when his son arrives on Sunday. It's so cool. Yeah. Hey, I <laughs> like this one. I like this one. That is what I'm talking about. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, but talking about celebration, I need new clothes now. So that that day to me, I'll be happy and shiny. Yeah. Neke, what's wrong with the clothes you're putting? Which one? Nka. Nka, how much has it gone? <laughs> ah, not to worry, my this. love. You know, I'll always get you new clothes. You no, I'll wear your own. Have you suddenly decided to remarry? Um, but you, these things you see here are for a welcome home party that I'm throwing on Sunday. Uh, uh, welcome. Uh, sorry, then let me <laughs> let me pay him. Ah, uh, all this just to bring it from the market. <laughs> but this is too much now. We'll we begin now. Huh? Where is the person coming from? I know it is a to you, but I'm welcoming home my son. Your son? <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, Daisuji, yeah. you know, you know that all of us know that you are important. So when is it that you had this, your son? Um, but actually, this son was born to me long before my accident. Thank God for you. Thank God. <laughs> Thank you. 
Like, and, and the most wonderful aspect of the story is that I never knew that this boy existed until he came looking for me. <laughs> Wait a minute. He was even the one that went in search of you. Exactly. There is Uchi. Huh? Are you sure he's your son? Are you sure he's not one of these boys that are roaming around the streets looking for who to do? Ah, no, 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 but he is nothing of that sort. In fact, information I got says that the boy is exactly my son. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you, eh? Yeah. Um, Mbuchi, uh, with this good news now, I am hoping that uh, we push aside all differences and you come and celebrate with me as I welcome home my son. And I do my eh? I'll do that. Yeah. I will even come and dance. Dance for you. I got here again, Mokuma. I'll come and dance with you and eat too. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it will mean a lot to me, eh? Ah, okay. Trust me, I'll be there. Okay. I will come and dance with you and and eat with you. Exactly. Eh? Exactly. That will mean a lot to me. Ah, don't uh, worry. Uh, you see me there. I'm going to die young. I'm going to be able. Hey! 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 Wait until you are killed. Don't worry. Oh, you're not going anywhere. Awesome. Eh? <laughs> Would you help me carry some? Eh. Eh, let's just think about it. Carry the small one, carry the jam. Ah. Eh, put his light for yeah. you. My waist. Eh? So that you don't break your waist. Eh. The first one. Mm. When I'll do the dance. Eh. <laughs> oh. ah. Baba. Oh, now. Oh, good afternoon. Afternoon. This one, you're home early. Hope all is well. All is well. You see, I took an excuse from the office to go to the market to get you this gift. What is this? Check it out. Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God! Oh, I, hope, I hope you like it. I love you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, I hope you like it. Oh, this for me, of course it's I do. for you. Okay. Oh, this is beautiful. You see, I want you to look good on the day we're going to see my father. Oh, Bina, you're a son every father should be proud of. Oh, come on, Mama. You see, I'm just being unnecessarily anxious and excited. Don't worry. Me? All your anxiety will be put to rest come on Sunday. Exactly. I know deep down in my heart that all oh, this is going to be a happy reunion. A real happy reunion. Yeah. <laughs> but all thanks to you. All thanks because to God. Because you made it possible. No, it is yeah? God. I <laughs> Thank you. I love you, Mama. I love you too, son. So, I love um, what did you what did you prepare? <laughs> Everywhere. Jesus, oh, hey, God, I bite every piece of vanities and powers. Oh, hey. 
It's, it's nothing. But it's yes, yes, yes. What? It's just that Day is a cheat died last night. Oh my god! What? No, 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 no. Hey, hey, fuck! Hey. Somebody help, please help! Mama! Stand up. Mama! Hey! Oh, we are going. Oh, yeah. You mean all this is what happening and you care quite about it? What were you thinking? They said the death of my two wives was just a mere coincidence. And that of Onyema dying of heart attack. But <laughs> this, this which is death. Hmm. If that is so, why are their spirits roaming around the compound at night? Explain is it just dead to me? Please. Okay. Days which is dead is not only shocking, but personally. I think something is wrong somewhere. Oh. Honestly, I think something is seriously wrong oh. somewhere. Thank God. You have realized it. Ebuka, there is a lot wrong with our family. It's time we went searching for the truth. Chifubaka, are you saying that someone or something killed my father? Does anyone know why the wicked do anything they do? It is possible, my son. There is nothing ordinary from what your uncles just told us. <laughs> Especially the visits of the spirits. Mama, I want to kill my father. Okay. <laughs> That's so good. Cool. What am I living for? I'm going here for you. Okay? That's, okay. That's all right. That's all right. It's okay. It's okay. You still have me. It's okay. That's okay. Right. Papa is dead. <laughs> Mama, you can leave me now. Mama, you can pass in your son. Papa is dead! 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 I don't know. 
All I know is that it is time for me to leave this place. Because I cannot stay here and wait for whatever it is that is killing everybody to come and take my own life too. I am not going to touch anything in my life, so leave me, I'm leaving. No, no, nothing will happen to you, Bikono, eh? Stay with me, you are my wife. If you leave me, what do I do? How do I cope? Eh? What do you want me to do, Ibuka? Have I not tried? Eh? So, you just want me to stay here and die? Hey! I am scared, I don't want to die. Neka, you, you won't die? <laughs> Neka, listen, I, I, I promise to protect you with the last drop of my blood. I will do it. Nothing will happen to you. Let's just stay here and fight this together. Be cool, Lulu. How? No, how? How do you fight evil? I don't how? know, but I, I believe we can withstand this. Okay, hey. listen. Neka, you know. Ever since my mother died, you have become my mother, my father, my <gasps> whole world. Oh. Hmm? Does the hand leave its cheek? Give me a please. And honestly, I can you explain? Yeah. You will not understand, Ebuka. Eh, you will not. A sacrifice must be made Holy. to stop. Holy. 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 Yes. 
to stop the devil from devouring other members of the family. Yes. Yes. Hey, hey. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. 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 Hey. Yes. That sacrifice must be made. Because the devil has planned to finish each and every one of you from that family. Hey, 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 hey,
So I can be close to my mom. Though I'll be working there for a while now before I came over here to see my father. I know you guys are tired. This one, Obina is talking and yawning at the same time. Chineke, it's almost midnight and we're still here talking. Jesus. Serious. Well, um, considering the way we've been uh, seeing our wives and brothers these days visiting us at night i think we should be uh, actually um, careful thank god all that has been taken care of mm, thank god for the pastor yeah me too ah. but i was not here to experience that mm. did you hear that did you hear what i heard ebuka oh ebukin oh bure ebuka see you had again eh I have Ebuka now. Ebuka! Ebuka! I'm here, to ask you if you slept well last night, do I? Last night? I've never been scared like I was last night. 
But does something have to be done about this? It's now obvious that the sacrifices made by the white garment church here didn't do anything. Obviously, it didn't work. And that's why presently I am planning to go out to make inquiries on where to find solution. Please, um, something has to be done. Okay? Please, I um, have an appointment in the office. I have to rush off. Okay, okay. I'll see you when I come back. Right. Have, have a nice day. day. All right. Hey. Yes, Onyozi. This is so strange. You mean the same goat is standing in the middle of your compound? Exactly, Onyozi. We came out and we saw it. Um, you know what? Don't be afraid. We'll go there, okay? Um, let me call my brother. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning. Take him, Mama. I've Mama. not seen her for a while. Ah, <laughs> Mama is fine. Thank you. Are you sure? Ah, uh, uh, Mama. Ah, uh, Mama. Who is that? Do we have a visitor? No, Mama. No problem. Oh. It's you. Yes. So you're still here. Mama, I don't understand. Where else do you expect me to be? Amaka. Mama. He's sweeping himself off. You can go into the house now. Huh? Well, Mama, I've not finished now. I said, come inside the house. Mama! Get into the house. Mama, take it easy. 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 
Ja? Amata, please wait now. Amata, come to car again, me. What is it? Is that thing I've been discussing with you now? You know, I want that young Toko now. Mm -hmm. eh? Toko won't we get back. Hey, what do I have told you and I will continue to tell you? I am not interested in you. Am I the only young girl in this village? Amaka, do you think I'm not man enough? I can get you pregnant though. After all, is that not why uh, Mbechi married you? Unduka. Unduka. She's just a stupid, drunk, palm wine tapper. And I don't have time for your likes. Uh, no problem. But you see, eh? Uh, I will not. See, this untok, you must give hey, it to me. Hey. What's going on here? Huh? What's going on? Hey, will you get your leprous hands off her? What's the problem? Oh, uh, what? Amaka, so he's the one you are giving the untok, right? Shut up! Shut up that your drunken mouth. I you shut up, Egwa? No problem. Amaka, I will shut up. Mr. Man, you see? Today is your own turn to eat the untoko. My own turn will come. I wait patiently because they say the patient dog eat the fattest bone. Hey, 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 you listen to me, okay? In this case, there's no dog and there's no bone. And the next time I see you hoving around her, you see what I will do to you. Amaka, get into the car, let me drop you. Get into the car, let me take you home. So, so you want? Listen to me. Okay, my final one. Be careful. Is it because of this carton? That the car is very guys. careful. Be very careful. You were tired. I don't know what they call it. Be you very careful. Tired. By the time he is tired, you will come back to me. Huh? Yeah, no, 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 no. no problem. Oh no, she's not my mother. I mean, that's not the reason. Oh. Oh, thank God. Because I was beginning to wonder how a very troublesome woman like that can give birth to a humble and decent girl like you. Well, that's by the way. So what do we do to the drunk? The war we saw bad there. Oh, Unduka. Mm. Don't mind Unduka, he's not a problem. I should not worry about him. Did you hear what he said to you back there? I said, don't mind him. It's okay, all right, fine. Um, so tell me, um, how are you related to Mama Mbuchi? Is she um, your auntie? Is she your... Just, how are you related to her? <laughs> She's my... Yeah, Amaka, come now, come now. Mama, good, good, good afternoon. Mama Bichi, I just offered her a lift, nothing much. It's as bad as that. If you know how bad it is, eh? You won't say what you're saying now. Uh -uh. Mama Bichi, I don't understand, dude. Don't understand. I don't understand. Don't worry. Eh? Next time I see you sniffing around, ar around Amaka, like a he got in it, eh? You will understand. After I had poured a whole pot of hot water on you. Oh, you. Mama, stop this thing now. You are embarrassing me. Ha! Ha! I'm going to get inside the house. You are right, oh, because we will never have anything to do with him as long as I'm alive. Mama Bechi, just a lift, too. Just a lift, too. Stay away from Amaka. So they have sent you. They have sent you to come and co contaminate uh, my, my offspring with your bad blood. Go and tell them to not work. I said it. Mama Bechi, just a lift, too. Just a lift, too. Just... Carry this box and leave this place. Let me see you enter this thing again. Wake up, or have water and shake, or wake up, or have water and shake, or wake up, or have water and shake. I gave you a deck, and you may have pumped it on my hand. I should tell you that that which has no solution. His solution is here in the shrine. The solution is here. <laughs> Thank you, Great Otagurago. Thank you very much. You are worth I encourage you. You are welcome.
My son, I believe you instructs that you should write down all the problems that led you to this shrine. My son, you have lost your two wives, both with child. That's true. <laughs> You're right. Although your wife is not dead, but she's with child, there is an air of doom hovering around her. I mean hovering around her. You have lost your two brothers. And there is a scourge of death in your family. Even your father died untimely. <laughs> yes, your, your words are indeed the truth. But that's the reason we are here. We, we want a solution. Yes. The reason the dead have refused to rest is because even in the land of the living, they are rejected. And also in the land of the dead, they are not welcomed. Why? My son, whatever that is happening to you is from your family. Kaputra. Munu What? That can be true. How? Who are you to doubt Abala Ijele? Who are you? The great Otawurago. We're not questionable, Jerry. We're only surprised. That's all. The Ijele is angry. You people have angered Ijele. It's my shrine. Uh, uh, I said you should leave my shrine. Let's go, Tabrago, please. Please, pardon us. Uh, please, please, no, 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 please, please. You should leave my shrine. Great Ijele! Give my shine! The cause of death shall follow you people! Go! You are welcome. The people you told me about have come, and I sent them away more confused. I heard all your words. You did well. And for your confidence, Ijele will pay that which he owes you. And as for them, confusion will forever be their lot. Everything is wrong. Talk to me. I'll understand. 
I'm just thinking about all the sudden things that have been happening in this family. All the bad things that have been happening in this family. Can you believe? Can you believe that my father died the day I was supposed to meet him? Chai. Tell me. It's a pity, eh? Sorry. Sorry, I know it is very, very painful. Eh? For you not to see your father at all. It is painful. Sorry. And the most painful part of it is that every night the spirit knocks at the doors and the windows. Hey! Screaming! Spirit! I'm telling you! Hey! Ruby Naibi Akwa! How? Don't tell me you don't hear it. No! I don't hear anything. Even Mama? If Mama has heard it, she will tell me now. Obina. Obina, is this thing true? Are you just trying to make me afraid? Ah, how can I joke with that kind of a thing? Chimo. I'm serious. Hey. Spirits. I'm scared. This house. Really God's intervention in this family. Hey. I'm telling you. Spirits. Spirits. Jesus. Obina, you scared I'm the life sorry, out of me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't <sighs> you. Okay? Actually, I came out to pay. Yeah, and I know you came out to do the same thing too. Well, by looking at you, it seems a lot of things are going through your mind. Yes. A lot of things are going through my mind. Like <laughs> ghosts. <laughs> you don't have to, okay? Actually, I'm, I'm sorry. It's my fault. I shouldn't have told you this. Yes. You shouldn't have told me because since you told me that story, I've been so scared. I don't even sleep at night. <laughs> you don't have to be, okay? Well, let me leave you to do your thing while I go back there and do mine. All right? All right. See ya. <laughs> wow, baby. Uh. <laughs> So you know how to do this, yeah? Ah, ah. Huh? Oh, cool. You children of nowadays, eh? You don't have respect to? Mama the mama. Mama, chill now, you know everything. I'm chilling. Eh? Why don't you people go inside? Huh? Okay, mama. <laughs> okay, let me get something. Alright. <laughs> give me this, give me this, let me get this. <laughs> Neka. Neka. What is going on here? What else if not what you just saw? Mama Uboshi's baby shooter is finally here to see if he can make her pregnant. Wait, 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 wait. I don't understand. I mean, what do you mean? Mama Uboshi's what? Amaka her wife now. Amaka is whose wife? Wait, 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 wait. You have not heard. Heard what? They've not told you. Is uh, Mama Mbuchi's wife now? She married her so that she can come here and bear children to continue her husband's lineage. So it doesn't matter who makes her pregnant as long as she's pregnant. Every man in this village is allowed to have a go at her. Kedi, Good God. I don't believe you. Hmm. I don't believe you. My dear, I won't blame you because I didn't believe it myself. I mean, how could she indulge herself in such a dirty act? I have asked myself that question over and over again. So right now, I have decided not to allow anything that in there to disturb me. And if you seek my opinion, I will say, don't allow it bother you too. Um, do you want me to get food for you? Food? I'm not hungry, please. I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. If you allow what they are doing to make you starve, hmm, you will get pain in this house. So just don't bother yourself. Ogubu said that your hearts are greatly burdened. You have come to seek about the dead and what happened to them. Uh, yes, great, great one. The eyes of Ogubu. Not only that, we have also come to find out if what struck threatens to strike again and if it does what do we do great one hmm. 
Nganga maranganga Aukona uwa Nganga maranganga Aukona uwa Nganga maranganga Aukona uwa Ebezina Ebezina Ebuzina First of all, we must find out if someone had a hand in the death of your loved ones. And then we shall ask Ogubu for solutions. You have to mention their names one by one. If they appear standing, that means no one had a hand in their death. If they appear sitting, that means someone had a hand in their death. Mention their names. Nganga Maranganga Ukonawa And you see Nganga Maranganga Nukonawa Nganga Maranganga Ukonawa Ebuzina, Ebuzina, Ebezina. Name. Nganga Maranunganga, Ankona Unu. Beatrice. And you sing Ganga Maranunganga, Ankona Wu. Nganga Maranganga, no Ankona Wu. Nganga Maranganga, Ankona Wu. Ebezina, Ebezina. Ebuzina. Hmm. Go. Nest. Nema. Hmm. Ani se nunga gama na nunga gano. Apa muko na u. Ani se nunga gama na nunga gano. Muko na u. Ebuzina. Ebuzina. Ebezina. Go. Nest. Ego. Enganga maranganga. Aukona uwa. Ebezina. 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 Go. Nest. My father is Uchi. I sing ganga mana nung ganga. Aung ko na u. Ebuzina e. Ebuzina. Ebezina. Go. Hmm. Hmm. Dosia. Scotch of death. Hovering around your family. <laughs> Ogugu said that sacrifices must be made to cleanse the scotch of death hovering around your family. Great one. We are ready to pay anything. Anything. Anything you say, we are ready to pay as yes. long as this agony will stop. Ogubu requires male and female squirrel, a chameleon, seven two bars of yam, an animal without backbone. And the sacrifice must be made here in Ogubu Shrine. And all your families. Great one. Most of these items you just mentioned are beyond our reach. Yes. 
how are we able to get male squirrel? Animal without backbones? Uh, uh, it's no problem. Get me the money and all the items must be made ready. Ah, well, how much is it? Uh, <laughs> Just the way you go. Great. Great one. Yeah. Great one. Yeah. Huh? Dosaria. Yeah. Oh, They are here again. <laughs> hmm. Ale de mana. Maguma. Ale de mana. Ale de mana guma guma ale de mana asando ale de mana guma guma ale de mana ale de mana guma guma ale de mana ebuga ale de mana guma guma ale de mana obi ale de mana guma guma ale de mana naka ale de mana guma guma ale de mana ale de mana guma guma ale de mana Ale de mana guma guma ale de mana These are the ashes from the items of Bubu required This necklace buried in these ashes shall serve as a mark of protection <laughs> mm. Mm. Obubu tebe 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 ah Obubu tebe na bialanga go Obubu tebe 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 ah Obubu tebe na bialanga go Obubu tebe nu lezibe tebe ah Obubu tebe na hano no ngagio Obubu tebe 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 nu ah Obubu tebe na hano no ngagio Obubu tebe letanu tebe nu ah Obubu tebe na bala ngagio Obubu tebe tebe this amulet you are wearing, you can also put it under your pillows if you don't want to use it or wear it on your neck. You have tried. Don't do. I must tell. I must tell him about it. I'm <laughs> If you like, go to heaven and tell God. I say, I'm not doing. I am not doing. Ah! No, no, please, no. please, no. Oh my God. Ah, no, 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 it's, it's not like that. It's for real. It's I, not like I, what? I love you. Hey! Forget about this thing. No, Abu Bakwako. Leave me alone, Afmaka. Please, no. Again, please. Nothing. Hmm. 
Okay. Come on, get out. Idiot. Come now. Come, so you can't try it. Amen. Hey, yes. Okay. What are you doing here? Okay. No, what are you doing here? I've come to explain. Explain what? Huh? That you got married to your fellow woman, an old woman for that matter, and you're sleeping with every Tom, Dick, and Harry in this village just to get pregnant for no! her. No! That is not the way it's in. <laughs> because I know it is not possible for you to be in a den of prostitutes. Amaka, stop now. Eh? I just came here to apologize to you. I'm sorry for everything. Oh, yeah. Please. Obina, Biko, please, please, please. There is no hair. Just go to your den of righteousness and leave prostituting. Amaka is okay now. Oh, being a half a prostitute, eh? leave I me. Wronged you. I know circumstances can make someone do things he or she doesn't want to do. I'm sorry. Because, you know. Hmm? Because, no, no, no. Ozola, no. Hmm? Hmm. <laughs> so, how are you? Hmm? What's been mm -hmm. happening? Mm -hmm. hmm? Look at you. Mm -hmm. See your mouth. <laughs> hey! hey! What am I saying? Mama, well, welcome. Tamaka. What are you doing with this? This thing, with torture? Mama. Override, Papa. Mama, Listen. not seen. We, 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 we. Have I not warned you? Eh? Never to be seen by the side of this this thing. This he got. Mama, Mama Betty, I, I didn't do anything, no. I didn't do anything. I just came to see Amaka. As your wife for what? Amaka. So it is because of this override papa. Potter potter. Eh? This Ochako Amaka. Because of him, you had to slap Samson and chase him away. Samson wa hamara mama. Handsome boy. Amaka, have I not wanted to stay away from him? Mama Opina does not have anything to do with Samson and Nayo. He's mm -hmm. my life. He's my life. Allow me to make my own choice now. What useless life and what useless choice are you making? Is it? Come again. Amaka? Come on. Amaka? Mama? Oh! Ah, yeah, no! Oh, my God. Oh, she only knows. I have warned you before. Let this be the last time you will come and interfere with one witch's house. Mama, Mama, Mama Bigo, Mama Bigo, Mama Bigo, Bigo, Bigo. Come on, you shit. Is it wrong? Emuka. Obini. No, no, no. Papaya. Mama Bigo, don't be wrong. Mama Bigo. Emuka. Lanya, Papaya. Dear Monty, Amaka is Mama Bigo's wife. Tell him. Leave them to live their lives. Enola. Ubalawa. Munyem. Wife. My wife. No, no, no. Awo Munyem. It's a wife. Enoria. Enoria. If I see you here again, eh? Okay, so why? You forget our love. You are my love. What is wrong with you? What is it? Are you stupid? What is it? Are you mad? It's your memory. It's your own one. Can you open it? In a gym, can you? Of all the girls in this village to get involved with, is Dambuchi's wife. Ah ah! Obinan! 
Are you mad? See, brother, eh? See, it's not as if I'm getting myself involved with Tamaka. But you see, each time I set my eyes on her, I feel the pain she's passing through. Eh? Just understand. Shut up, my friend. You are not serious. Be quiet. You and I know that Dan Wichi is a cavern of trouble. Eh? And we've been doing everything to avoid her. You ought to be doing the same. Shh. Now listen to me. If Amaka needs a savior, definitely not you. Yes. There's something you people are hiding from me. Tell me. Eh? Talk to me now. Let me know. Let me know what's happening. What's going on here? Okay. Ruby. We want you alive. We are not hiding anything at all from you. All we want you is to be reasonable, to be sensible. Listen. Watch. Damn, boy, anything that concerns her, if she's coming from this angle, run! Nah, wah! Bows! Nanya! In here! Bows! Just greet her as if you like her. Run! That woman will kill you, Ellie. Oh. I don't trust her. And put an end to whatever madness is going on between you and Amaka. She has chosen her path. Let her live with it. Okay! Okay? Be wise. Ema raso, iso ni kwe. Ema raso, gaso na patagi onye wana ente ya no. Hey. Oh good. Hey. Oya na ako. Eh? Mama Beji, Amaka, wife. Oh oh good. What do you mean you could not do anything? Eh? That boy is a mere pest. Cockroach. Ordinary cockroach. Do you want to tell me that your power has gone so low that you cannot kill an ordinary cockroach? That boy is well protected. I was struck by a bright light when I tried to take away his life. What useless bright light are you talking about? You and I know that that talisman is fake. I was the one that prepared it. It cannot protect any of them, not even one of them. What are you talking about? <sighs> it's not the talisman that has the power. I feel it's the kind that comes from above, from the creator. It seems he's a covenant child. No! No! I refuse to believe that. Abali Jale promised me. They cannot fail me. They cannot. Izuchi son must die. What is Bina. it? What is it? Why are you so scared of her? Bina, I'm scared. See, I'm beginning to see her for who she truly is. Every night I spend in that house, I spend in fear. And in the morning, I just look for something to... an excuse to get away from her present. Okay, okay. I know what the problem is. I know it's because of the way she treated you the last time. Ha! No. Far from that, Obi. You know you've been very nice to me. Okay. I must warn you. You have to be very careful. Mama Mbechi plans ill for you. How? I mean... What do you mean? See, I overheard her talking to something. I don't know. She said you must die. Hey. That, that is a promise she made to somebody or somebody made to her. Promise? How? By who? I um... don't know. Whooping, I don't know. See, I'm so scared. And I'm beginning to think that Mama Mbuchi is the cause of all the evil that has befallen your family. No, no. I don't believe that. <laughs> Mama Mbuchi might, she might be wicked, arrogant, impudent, but she can't do it. <laughs> Bro, what's up? Okay. I don't know, I'm scared. What's the, what's the problem? 
I haven't heard anything since they went into the labor room. Ah, and I've been there? sitting here since, yes. Where's the doctor? He's still in there. Let, let's, let's go and know what's going on there. Okay. Huh? Doctor, talk to us now. What's going on? Well, um, Ebuka. Yes. Be a man. And as a man, you're bound to see anything. I don't understand. I am asking about my wife who was in the labor room. Has she been delivered of a baby? Well, I'm sorry. Due to some unforeseen circumstances, we lost your wife and the baby. Jesus, Jesus Christ. No. What? You. She what? Jesus Christ. No. No! I said take it. No! She can't die! The talisman was supposed to protect her. Take it easy. No, she had the talisman! Calm down. Calm down. Doctor, where's my wife? Doctor, where is she? Ebuka, be here. Where's my wife? Ebuka, where's my wife? Now wait. Take it. Calm down. Calm down. Where's my wife, doctor? Osondo. Ebuka. And Obina. Indeed. Our people used to say that. What is bigger than the ant has entered the ant's hole. Yawa he can't have an I am totally short of words. How can this be? After everything you have done. How can this be? Uncle, the question is, who is behind such an evil? What has our family done to that person to warrant such a magnitude of evil unleashed on us? That reminds me. You see, I was with Tamaka the other day. And she told me something that gave me goosebumps. She told me that she believes Mama Mbechi is behind the problem we are passing through in this family. I beg. I'm serious, though. I'm serious. Mama Mbechi? Yes. Is behind this evil. See, I know Mama Mbuchi is wicked, eh? but she's only a woman. She cannot be behind such wickedness, such magnitude of evil coming from a woman. Mama Mbuchi, no, 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 I, 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 I doubt it. We cannot overlook any possible suspect on this matter. I want you all to be prepared. I am going to get to the root of this. Oh, I'm not Obaka. Enough is enough. We can't take this again. I have been waiting for you. But before you enter into the shrine of Ife, you must be pure. If you know you are not pure, don't follow me. But if you are pure, you follow me. Now that you have made it to the shrine of Inye, the shrine of life, you must drink from the pot of life since you said you are pure.
sit down there. You come. Drink. Sit down there. You go. Sit down there. You move to the extreme. You sit down there. Obaka, Osando, Ebuka, Obina. You are welcome to the Shrine of Life. I've long been expecting you for he has foretold you are coming. Someone else is with you here. Uh, uh, great one. It, it, it's true. It's only four of us that made this journey to your great shrine. Mm -hmm. mm. You're not here alone. I can feel the spirits of a sudden soul. The spirit of a young girl with a newborn baby. Yes. Yes, she is carrying a baby. I can see it. Great yes. one. That must be the spirit of my wife. She died while giving birth to our baby. Is your wife not buried? We decided we would not bury her until we would get to the root of all the evil things happening in our family. Ah, uh, he tells me that you all know the cause of the calamity in your family. We have? Osando. You didn't tell your brothers what happened to you after eating that night when they left. Even you, Ebuka, you didn't tell them that you were slapped by the, ev the evil dwarf when you went out to urinate. Ah, the dwarf? I, I didn't want to tell them because I knew they wouldn't believe me. I mean, I couldn't even believe it myself. Oh my god. This one. She made me. That was same reason. I did not say anything because everybody would have thought I was mad. Yeah, there, 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 there's no way they would have believed that I, 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 saw, I saw a dwarf. And you kept quiet. Even you, Obina. You didn't tell them what happened between you and a dwarf. Even though your chi it was more powerful. Um, good one. Yes, it's true. I, the dwarf, who is he? Because I've seen him before. I've seen him before. Yes. What? Yes. The question is not who is the dwarf, but who is the dwarf representing. Please, we pray you, great one. Tell us. You have to think back. Who do you always quarrel with? And later you see the evil dwarf. Mbechi. Yes. Mbechi. She is the cause of all the calamities and all the deaths in your family. Jay! Chineke. Mbechi. Ami Samaka is right. Do you mean that woman is evil? Great one. Who is this dwarf? 
I mean, who is he? What have we done to her? Why? My sons. The wise a long story. It all started a long time ago when your family had a great battle with their enemies who swore to seize their lands and kill everybody in the family, including your grandfather, your brothers and uncles, with the exception of your father and his elder brother, Ozona Mbechi's husband. Oh, it was a big calamity. Who killed you, my brother? What are we going to do? Why are you asking me what are we going to do? Did you not hear the Dibia? We only have a short time. All we have to do is to do every necessary thing to safeguard our lives and the lives of our children. Okay, wait. Yes, How mean? can what is necessary be my marriage to the messenger of our? Okay, wait. How can I marry another woman when you know that I already have a wife? In fact, okay, wait. Why didn't the Abara choose you instead of me? How can the Abara choose me? Go and ask the, the, the Abara why he, why he chose you. Is, is, after all, is he not for the interest of the family? Okay, well. Yes, Ozana. But how are we sure that bringing home the Abara will safeguard our lives? Okay, well. Yes, Ozana. Will it really assure our safety and protection? Yes. I strongly believe. Are you sure? Oh, yes, I strongly believe. <laughs> if we can earnestly do okay, we do. what we are supposed to do. And so it was Uzona who accepted to marry the messenger of the deity, Umbechi, for the protection of their family. Awala protected Ozonna and his family and they were able to get back their lands but Ozonna failed to fulfill his own part of the bargain. Great one. But how did my uncle fail? He failed because he loved his first wife so much and maltreated Mbechi, his second wife. And the outcome is what you can now imagine. Mbechi resorted to revenge? Mbechi was so provoked that, he, that she called her Abala for a revenge. And that was when her Abala started to kill your family. Fathers, behold thy daughter. Behold, I have been rendered useless and childless by those who have received so much from you. You must avenge my condition. This is my decree. Since I have no offspring, no offspring shall be born in this family. No male, no female shall ever set his or her eye on a child 
in this family until they are all wiped away from the surface of the earth. This is my decree, and so shall it be. Receive this as a sacrifice for my demand. <laughs> Thank you, great Abara. <laughs> there is a saying that the fury of hell cannot be compared with a woman scorned by a man. Mbechi, Mbechi practically lived the life of an outcast in her own husband's home. After quarrel with Ozona's wife, out of bitterness, she cried to Awala for revenge. And that was how the killings and the deaths began. Hey, God, oh, no wonder. Chash, wicked woman. After her husband's death, her father did not accept her properly as a wife as she has expected. Even Ukiwe also rejected her, but only made sure that she never lacked anything. Mechi, Mechi's anger and bitterness continued to feast her, and the more she cried, the more she cried, the more her abala went after those that have offended her. Uh, great one, you know, you speak with so much wisdom. We want to understand because we are lost. Yes. The maltreatment, is it as a result of the husband not taking care of her, not providing for her, or as a result of not sleeping with her, or I mean, that, 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 that makes her, you know, feel this bitter that each time that we had little quarrel, the next minute we'll see the dwarf, and after the dwarf, that will be death. Yes. Oh, indeed, that was what happened. Great one. If she's the one doing all the killings, why is my uncle still alive? Is it not better for a man to live a miserable life than to die? Mbechi made a covenant and decreed that since she doesn't have a child, no woman in your family will ever have an offspring. Or whoever has, she will make sure that everybody is wiped off from the face of the earth. Hey! Deizuchi. Dietrich. Eko. And the Neka. They all died as a result of Mwichi's decree. Really? Really? Great one. How do we stop her? We can't allow Mwichi to totally wipe out our family. We've got to stop her. Yes. What do you do to somebody you have terribly wronged? Ask for her forgiveness, of course. Of course, that's what you are supposed to do. And this will take you to make some sacrifices. Buy some gifts. The kind of gifts a woman will love and cherish. Take some elders with you and go to her and ask for her forgiveness. Great one. This woman we are talking about here is very wicked. From the story you told us, we have confirmed that she is a very wicked woman. So, how do we know that she will accept the gift we are about to give to her? Do it first. And let's get her response, which will make or break her. Yes? 
No, no problem, no problem. Is Mama around? Eh, she said that she come and find out what you want. Okay. Just go inside, tell her some visitors are here to see her, okay? Oh, now. I hope all is well. All is well. Just go and call her. Yes. Who oh, is it that said that you will not have rest in What is it? Mbuchi, our wife, the great mother of our family. We are here to see you. To see me for what? Huh? I'm not having any party. And I have not sent out invitation cards to all and sundry. We know that already. Brother, we have come to honor you, our great wife and mother. Honor me for what? Amaka, what is the meaning of all this? What are they honoring me for? Eh? What have I done to deserve honor? And what are these being here? Uh, Mama, we brought them to you. We, we, we just wanted to say thank you for what you have been doing for our family all these years. Hassan, what are you talking about? Are you sure you have not mistaken me for somebody else? Uh, uh, no bother. Uh, actually, we we have learned the truth of how you saved our family from um, your Abala's uh, hand. You know, from the Abala wiping away our entire family years ago. Yes, ma'am. And we realized that our fathers would not have been appreciative of what we did for them. Yeah, that's why we brought all these things to say, Mama, please, what you want to see is in any way how wronged you or our forefathers may have wronged you without knowing. We, we are asking that they, they just let your hand and see it. Because you're here, this paltry gift that you have brought will, will appease me. Eh? Do you know the enormity of what your forefathers did to me? They have not even begun to pay at all, at all. Now get up. Get up, get up. Please, please. The say to bear is human and to forgive is divine. Don't vent your anger on them for whatever crime their fathers and my own father and grandfathers have committed. Please, Mbeji, our lovely mother and wife. Why are we even here begging this woman? Why should she be the one begging us? I mean, I'm a joke. Let them come, because happen, bro. Happen, Bito. Woman, haven't enough life been shared for the sins of one man? Huh? No! We are all guilty by the reason of blood. When one finger dips into oil, Invariably, it affects the rest of the fingers. It's too late. It's only you. Mama, leave him alone! What has this boy done to you? Leave him alone! Amaka, mind yourself. Know how you get yourself involved in what you know nothing about. Mama, I heard everything. I know your plans to kill Obina. Mama, why are you so wicked? What are these people done that you cannot forgive? He has done everything by mere existing. Nobody, I mean no one, blocks me like you did. Oh, I will wipe him away like I, your, your, your brother disappeared. What? Mama? You, you killed my brother? Yes, I did. How? Hey. I will kill any other one that tries to block my way. Get out of you! Why are you even here begging? Get out! Eh? Why are you begging this woman? Why should you be the one begging us? This will take me the way we get rich. Let me out! Open now. Dare challenge me again. Now let me tell you, eh? My chin is greater and bigger than that your as ancestors. Ah! 
Great Amara. Great Ijele. Hearken to the voice of your daughter. Let us finish what we have started. Kill them. Finish all of them. Finish them. Great Amara. They have begged you. You have to forgive them. No. I will not forgive them. They must die. If you not do it, I am going to do it by myself. My own way.